Hey everyone, this is Mike from Baseball Connect and we're going to be talking about Magnus Force. Magnus Force is one of the factors that helps us understand why a baseball moves. For example, how fastballs will break much differently than breaking balls. The Magnus effect was discovered in the 1800s by German physicist Gustav Magnus. Magnus examined why spinning artillery shells curved in unexpected ways. He came to the conclusion that spinning objects create a force opposite to the direction the object is traveling in, which impacts their movement. This effect can be applied to similar events such as a thrown baseball. Magnus force is an important concept because it is one of the many factors acting upon a pitch after release. Other forces can include velocity, gravity, aerodynamic effects, weather, and more. We know that fastballs are released with backspin as they travel toward home plate. Magnus force is the air pressure built up below the baseball, which counteracts the gravitational forces pushing downward, allowing the ball to drop slower, which can give the impression of rise. Keep in mind, the greater the spin rate, the more impact Magnus force can potentially have. This might explain why high spinning fastballs are sought after, because this trait can lead to greater movement profiles. When reviewing breaking pitches such as curveballs, we know they are released with top spin. This type of spin creates the exact opposite Magnus effect than fastball spin. The top spinning curveball creates more air pressure on top of the baseball as it travels toward the plate, magnifying the gravitational forces already acting on the ball. For this reason, curveballs move or break in a sharp downward path compared to fastballs. This type of force is applied to all thrown baseballs in some way dependent on their spin axis and pitch characteristics. Magnus force can play a huge role in affecting any thrown object, including baseballs. Having a comprehension of ball flight factors is important because it is the core of understanding why each pitch type moves the way they do.